Hey everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions video. So it's season 45, and this is war number eight. And we're going up against an alliance called Essex Corp. All right, let's see, who did they ban? Uh-oh. Silk, Void, and the one champion that I've just started to use, Quicksilver. Hmm. But that's okay because that frees up someone else. All right, let's uh, see what they got in store. Plan out our team. All right, so first up, we've got Venom. Whew. And we got Silk. Silk is not particularly difficult to fight, Unless I make a mistake or something. Venom, I believe if he gets that armor up, will benefit from the node. So I, I need to bring in somebody that can deal with that. Um, I mean, Corvus can. We might try that. We might try Corvus. We'll, we'll see. Um, Silk. We'll see. Uh, Corvus might be able to do this. Let's see who else we got. All right, definitely Corvus for that Viv Vision. And for that, hmm, Ant Man Future, we did uh, we did pretty well with a uh, Hulkling. And I know that. Um, Magneto can also uh, do that fight, but I might I might do um, I might use Hulkling there. All right, and we've got Weapon X, huh? I don't know. I think my um, huh on that node you can't use any energy. I think my Lady Death Strike is on defense. If not, I will bring her for that Weapon X. We also have this guy. I, um, I really don't want to mess with him. However, we can bring in Hercules. AQ is over. I love that change. And we can bring in Hercules to deal with some folks. Hmm. I might do that. Hercules could also handle this uh, silk here. So maybe Corvus, Hercules, and... Hulkling. Yeah. And then I can probably uh, take out one of these. I'll let them assign me. That's what we've been doing, why you don't see me um, saying I'm going to do this one. Because I might get assigned to someone else. So I basically um, secure my path. And then one of the officers looks over the team's and sees who has a good counter for who. But if I have Lady Deathstrike available, I will call that Weapon X. If not, I'll just bring in Hercules and let him uh, assign me someone. Let's see, we got up here, uh -huh, Maestro. Okay, so... One good thing, though, doesn't look like I have... Yeah, no one is a global defender. So that's good. So, yeah, Gallon can easily handle that um, Venom. If I bring Hercules or Corvus, they can each do that. Um, I could get a mission... 
from Silk. Hit her with a, a special, like a special one, and she should evade it. And uh, then I can just knock her down and get that um, evade mission. But yeah, Corvus, Gallon, Hercules, unless I have Lady Deathstrike. In which case, I'll do a Lady Deathstrike and come after that um, Weapon X. Yeah, Corvus. Oh, wait, 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 wait. I just named like four different people. I want Hulkling for this uh, Ant-Man. So Hulkling, Corvus, and either Lady Deathstrike or Hercules. Yeah, that's what we'll do. All right, let's get on with the fighting. All right, we're going in with Hulkling, Corvus, and Hercules. I don't often bring Hercules in because he's normally in Alliance Quest. But thanks to the new change, where I believe we only have like four days, we're already done. And the new AQ hasn't started yet. So I can bring uh, Hercules in, no problem. All right, now, this first fight, Venom, he's awakened. And I know he's going to get an armor up. I just know it. But that's okay. I could use Hulkling for this fight, or I could use Corvus. Now, in hindsight, I probably would have used Hulkling, but I decided to go in with Corvus. The reason is that Corvus, of course, can do an armor break. And, and why I was saying that perhaps I would do differently is because there's no benefit. He's not getting any charge from this. Now, notice once again, I'm slowing my combo down, okay? Doing medium light, and then he got the armor up right when I was in the middle of my um, attack. And when he has an armor up on this node, it drains my power, which is not what I want because it makes the fight go longer. But I'm doing medium light, and then I just get hit. It happens. I, I don't know why, it just happens, okay? So here we go. Hit him with that. And then bam, bam, bam. All right? Let him feel a little bit of something. All right? Now, here we go, back to the medium light. But look at this. Now my power, low. Uh, and my charges, only three left. So what do I do? He's got a lot of health left. Look at this. Now, medium. And then I just start doing lights. You know why? Because light attack does not use up my charge. Light. Boom. Light. And bam. Okay. Ooh, death. Use that striker. And now I can finish him. That took a lot more work than it should have. And after this, I didn't have any charge. So I could have just gone ahead and used Hulkling for that fight, and I would have been fine. Probably would have ended up with a lot more health at the end of it. But instead, I've got a low health Corvus, and I'm going to have to use him again, I believe. So anyway, that was the only reason I said that. This fight, I, I was pretty sure she did not get any armor ups, which means she doesn't benefit from this node. And it's a chance to get a few feats of strength for Hercules. All right, so here we go. We already got uh, one persistent feat of strength. We need to get an intercept. Okay, still trying to get that intercept. She likes to fire them specials, but that's fine. Bam, got the intercept. All right, look at that. 
Loving it. Loving it. Wham! Woo! Go! Hercules! Now she's stunned. Ooh! Right in the bread basket. Hercules. So that's going to give me two feats of strength, which just speeds things up a little bit. Uh, if I had gotten knocked down, that would have been the third one. But I'm not really interested in getting knocked down. Getting knocked down is usually a bad thing. Um, <clears throat> but we got our two feats. So the next fight that we um, use him on, we'll already have that starting up. Now, here... As you know, if you've been watching my war videos, Viv Vision, very easy with Corvus. But I'm not about to go into this fight with his health looking like that. Not me. I'm tired of dying. Don't want to die no more. Let's be careful. Boost up. Whatever. Okay? Definitely heal up. I was in an alliance where uh, you were required to record all of your fights. And if you didn't heal up and you lost, they were going to probably kick you. Okay. So here I'm looking and I'm like, hmm, do I need to use one of these? So let's do that anyway, just in case. Now, that was also something I would do. Uh, I had a lot of those silver boosts. And so to save my um, loyalty, I would sometimes do that. Now, watch this here. Notice I'm blocking because I don't want her to fire her special uh, one if I can help it. All right. So this one is a little bit beefier, but I'm not worried about her special two. Special two is fine. Fire that off, girl. Fire it off. There you go. Kick it. <laughs> now, they're running the um, ouchy masteries, too. So that's nice. That helps. I got six charges left. Parry. And she's done. Very straightforward, easy fight. Just have to be careful. And you just don't want to lose all your charges. And that special one, like I said, I know how to evade it. I just need more practice. And if it's unblockable, oh my goodness. And see, it's not unblockable all the time. So it, it, it takes some getting used to. Now, at this point in time, my Hulkling is rank five ascended. Watch this fight. Now look, bait, I, I waited out his armor up. Remember how we had that fight before and I made a nasty comeback? Look at this fight now. See, now I know how to fight. Now we good. Because that fight, I learned. I don't need to try to evade. I, I, I probably could if I learned it. Look at this. Boom. Oh, unblockable. Mm, look at all that power. Look at that. He tried to come right back at me. Mm -mm. I ain't trying to hear that. Look at them pierces. Oh, yeah. What you got? Oh, look at that damage. Look at them numbers. Yeah, keep blocking. I don't care. Look at how different that fight was compared to the first time when I almost lost. Just have to learn the fight. Hulkling's a beast. Okay. Very good for that uh, Ant-Man future. Uh, anytime I see him on that node, I'm going to bring Hulkling, if I can. If they um, ban Hulkling, I'll bring in Magneto. Now, I got assigned this one. And I think I was talking about uh, that I could take it with Hercules. And that's pretty much what I was told. The officer was like, just Herc it. Now, he knew that I was familiar with fighting Wolverine Weapon X, okay? He's not a fun one to fight. However, you don't have Lady Deathstrike, don't have Nimrod, don't have uh, Magneto, because Magneto would not work on this node, 
Um, and that's probably what they were thinking. But if you know how to fight Weapon X, you can fight him with anybody. Okay? So you can see here, I boosted up. I was not playing with it. Okay? <clears throat> so you see here, every time a regeneration passive is activated, if they're not under a heal block, they get vigor. And then if you get 10 vigor, they go unblockable. That is what was happening to me the last time when I was fighting with Quicksilver against Gore. Okay? Just so you know. Now, I'm like, okay, I'm ready. I have fought Weapon X before. I usually ban him in uh, Battlegrounds. So, invulnerability, just in case. Never know. And especially against Weapon X, you never know. All right? So, here we go. All right? All into my block, but that's okay. Bam. Come on. Yeah, we got you. All oh, intercept. Yeah. Bring it. Boom. Look at him. Go ahead. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Unstoppable and unblockable. Okay, can't go in. He's unstoppable. Nope. Back it up. Wait, he's not. Unblockable still there. Ha! Yeah. Caught you coming in. Oh, yeah. You unblockable, but it don't matter if I intercept you. Uh-huh. Stay away from me. Ooh. Coming in. What? Unblockable again? That's okay. Back up. Back up. Ooh. Right in the bread basket. And down. That is how you herk. Weapon X. No need. I didn't even need all them boosts. Well, the boosts help with the damage. But still, that is how you fight Weapon X. All right. We'll be back in a minute. And you will find out how this war ended. And we're back, and unfortunately, we lost this war. Now, right now, we're in a very precarious position. We are currently Platinum 3, rank 1. Since I've joined them, we've always been Platinum 2, as far as I can remember. Uh, it wouldn't be the worst thing, except we know we're capable of better. Now, in this particular war, shout out to Essex Corp. They played well, okay? Look at the defender kills. They just outplayed us. They didn't die enough. We died too much. But as I've noticed, we normally end up with around 20, 20, 22. So even if we performed as well as we have been performing, it wouldn't have done uh, good against them. They just played really well. Okay. Shout out to them and shout out to the MVPs for this war. Uh, now, I have heard and, and I agree, this meta really is bad. And combined with the uh, bans, and you know I don't like the banning system, but it does what it's supposed to do it squeezes you so that you have to make different rank ups. You saw me rank up Ant Man. Why? Because I needed more options in Alliance War. So it's working as intended. We just don't like it. Um, we like to rank up our champs that we like to play rather than out of necessity that was created by a system, you know? But yeah, this meta hasn't been the, the most fun. And the bands have been pretty crippling for a, a lot of people. Uh, but in any case, that is going to do it, guys. Thank you all for watching the video. Take care. Hit the like button if you enjoyed it. Leave a comment. Let me know what you thought about this video. And you all have a blessed day.